Hey, what's up YouTube? It's Quest again with your weekly vapor review. This week I've got five flavors. I picked them up from Love Vape up in um, Lansdale, PA, and Taffy owned one of those. It's, I'm not 100% sure of the address, but it's right down the road from me. Uh, I've done reviews for them before, uh, but this week I got five flavors from Vape Wild, actually. I picked them up there. Uh, we've got, uh, it is S plus C squared. It looks and smells like it's a strawberry cream. Also, according to this handy dandy little flavor guide here, uh, that's what it is. It is, an ex it is more strawberries, more cream, enough said. It's all it says. So it's a strawberry and cream flavor. Should be pretty interesting. I've done several of them before, but this one I smelled it and it smells absolutely fantastic. It's very strong. So we'll give that one a try in a minute. Uh, we're gonna go straight down the line that I've got them lined up here uh, and I'm telling you about it. So uh, just expect that. Uh, second, we are going to do Smurf Cake. This one is Vape Wild. I know I did another one, uh, Smurf Cake, by, um, from, uh, what is that place up there? It was uh, Quaker Vapor. Uh, and this is pretty similar uh, from the description. It is a blueberry and cheesecake. So, should be similar, but we'll see. Uh, third flavor we got is, it is Fruit Hoops. It's Fruit Loops. I mean, what more do you want me to say? <laughs> Uh, the, <laughs> this one, uh, I, the fourth flavor we're going to do is called Merica. Yes, I did just say that. Uh, it is a red, white, and blue pop, uh, lolly, not lollipop, but, um, you know, icicle pop thing. Yeah. Ice cream, whatever. Uh, the last flavor, I'm going to butcher this name. I know it. Uh, but it is, uh, Peche or Peche, uh, Guevara. It's guava and peach. So, smells pretty good, but it's going to be last because, as we all know, peach usually sticks in the, in the wick. So, those are the five flavors I've got for us. They are all uh, 65-35 uh, on the PG, or VG PG ratio, uh, and they're all three Nicks. This is what I was able to get from, you know, Love Vape to do for the review. They were all threes. I wasn't able to get my normal six, so let's give this a shot. And I love these, these are, the, 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 oh man, I can't talk. I love the artwork on these. Like each bottle is very, you know, decorated for their flavor, you know, which is actually really nice. So with, you know, no further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Starting with the strawberries and cream and going down the line. so strong as soon as I open up that bottle I just get hit with that that creaminess it, it smells like strawberry milk honestly uh, so you can't go wrong with strawberry milk fantastic vapor production it just it throws out vapor like there's no tomorrow very creamy. It's very smooth. It has almost no throat hit whatsoever. Uh, it is definitely um, a little bit of an undertone of the strawberry. It's one of the another one of those flavors that it just sits on your tongue. I'm still tasting strawberry afterward, and it is it is amazing. It's it tastes fantastic. So they did a really good job with this one. Oh, yeah. I really like that one. I wish I had them in six, honestly, because I'd, I'd vape on all of these. Well, this one specifically for days, and I wouldn't even switch up flavors, honestly. That one was so good. Next flavor is the... I'm only doing a couple drips, a couple drops per, because I want to get through this. Um, you know, I know you guys don't have all day. <laughs> so, uh, we're going to do the blueberry and cheesecake next. Uh, so, let's go ahead and give this one a shot. It smells so good. It smells, it smells creamy. It smells, you know, fruity. It smells what I would imagine a blueberry cheesecake would smell like. So. Mm. Um, that one, I get a lot more of the cakey flavor. I get a lot more of the, um, 
you know the the creaminess of like cheesecake and and the little bit of little bit of a crusty type flavor not so much blueberry on that so <clears throat> that's actually pretty nice it's not overpowering like a lot of the blueberry flavors i've had uh it, it's a nice combination of flavors a lot more cheesecake or just cake uh, than the blueberry which is a really nice um blend because as i said blueberry tends to overpower stuff so they did a really good job with that one as well Fruit Hoops is going to be my next flavor. It's the Fruit Loops cereal. Um, I'm kind of excited. I do a lot of cereal flavors, and a lot of cereal flavors usually have that overpowering uh, lemon taste to it. So I want to see how this one goes. Um, the, I still say the best cereal flavor I've ever had was the Kilo cereal milk because it wasn't overpowering with the lemon. It was a nice fruit blend with the creaminess of the milk. It honestly did taste like the milk left over from a bowl of Fruit Loops or Fruity Pebbles, which... I'm a sucker for Fruity Pebbles. All right, let's do this one. Sorry guys, you get to stare at my forehead for a second. Ooh, that one's actually fantastic. It does have that lemon taste at the end. It does have like a strong lemon taste. However, it is probably the closest to an actual Fruit Loops cereal flavor I've had. The, like I said, cereal milk is still probably my favorite, uh, but this one is very close second. Uh, it is, it is Fruit Loops. It tastes just like a bowl of Fruit Loops, which is fantastic because I have not had a cereal flavor that actually came as close as this one does because most of them like i said have that lemon taste that's just way too overpowering this one i can taste a little bit of different flavors in there uh, it's hard to pinpoint specific flavors but it is fruit loop cereal it tastes just like you know taking a bowl of toucan sam pouring it in the bowl and just going to town I, I don't even taste any creamy milk flavor on that it's just dry cereal which is fantastic you know saturday morning cartoons and you know cereal sitting in front of the television your mom yelling at you you're gonna go blind and you know childhood great vapor production it's just it's still producing massive amounts of uh, vapor, which is a great sign. And I have to let this sit for just a second. It's getting warm. Um, next flavor up is going to be Merica, which, like I said, is the red, white, and blue pop. Uh, it even shows it right there on the bottle, which is really nice. I did open this and smell it earlier, and it smells fantastic. I definitely can smell cherry in this more than anything else. Oh, man, it smells so good. Oh man, that's fantastic. That's a, that's a wonderful blending of flavors. Like I can't pinpoint any flavor specific. Like I can't say, okay, well here's a little bit of lemon, a little bit of blueberry or blue raspberry or whatever and cherry. It, it, it tastes like all of them and yet none of them. So it's actually a really wonderful flavor. It's a nice flavor. I would say it's definitely a nice flavor for summer. Uh, it's a nice warm yeah, well, it's, it's a warm vape because I vape it hot, but it's a nice flavor to have when it's hot outside, just something to vape on. You know, it, it's, it's a great flavor. That's one I would take with me pretty much anywhere I go. Try not to let it fog out the camera. Yeah, oh man, that's so good. Yeah. Last one is the uh, peach and guava. I'm not even going to try to mispronounce this name because I know I'm going to butcher it again. I did like, um, as soon as I opened this bottle, it's just a very strong, um, it's, a, it's a strong peach smell. But it's also like a citrusy almost smell, which is actually pretty nice. Uh, so I'm kind of excited to see how this one turns out. So... Let's go ahead and give this a shot.
That's a very it's a it's a very distinct flavor. Like you get a lot of peach on that. Um, it's it's very good. It is a very good flavor. Uh, it's a very strong peach flavor. I, I don't really taste anything else but the peach on that. Uh, but it is very good. So I'm going to recommend that flavor if you like peaches. Uh, that might be more of a tank uh, vape than dripping. Because then you you know tanks are usually built for flavor. Whereas dripping is you can go either way. You, you got great flavor or you blow out massive clouds. So it's depending on your build. Uh, but that one I'm getting a lot of peach. So I would recommend a tank for that one. But that's what I've got for you this week guys. Uh, as always have a great week and vape on.